Do you know how hard it is to stand here and look cute and try food that you know tastes good? It's like very stressful. He doesn't understand that. All he has to do is set up this stuff. That's all he has to do is put up some stupid lights and push record. I'm the one that does all the work. Oh yeah, he edits the videos. Clip, paste, add some music, blam. I'm doing all the hard work. Hey guys, it's me, Brittany, also known as Pineapple Vegan, and welcome back to my channel. So today is something a little different, not really too different, because obviously I'm making vegan food, but it's something I haven't done before. I am like a big fan of Harley Quinn. Oh, I haven't had breakfast yet. I figured why not make that epic egg breakfast sandwich from Birds of Prey. Even as a vegan, watching that movie, you see that part and you're like, dang, I want a, I want a breakfast sandwich. I like breakfast sandwiches. So I want one. I'm gonna make one. It's Sunday morning. I have my kafifi and my family's hungry. So let me tell you what you're gonna need for this breakfast sandwich. It's very simple, like the most basic breakfast sandwich ever. First you'll need ciabatta, cause that's what they used in the movie. And most ciabatta is vegan, um, just ask you know, the person that you're getting it from. I actually got these freshly made from the bakery in Whole Foods. I could smell them as I walked up to the counter. They literally pulled them out as I was walking up. It was almost like it was meant to happen, like the heavens just opened up and shined a light down on me. So I have my ciabatta rolls, I have my vegan bacon, and this is the All Vegetarian Inc. brand. Their website is sold out, but luckily, you guys can get this from VegCo. Use promo code FINEAPPLE25 for wholesale and FAVE10 for regular regular people like me. And you'll need your vegan cheese. It requires you to have American cheese. I only have one slice of American cheese. The rest of this is cheddar. I really don't care. I'm gonna use it anyway. You're gonna need your vegan egg. I'm using just egg. Also, you can find this at VegCo. But if not, then you can just get it from your local retailer. Um, just egg is available in a lot of retailers now. Any hot sauce that you want. And then I just have a little bit of grapeseed oil and a little bit of olive oil just to keep this from sticking, plant-based butter. So I'll put the measurements for this down below. This is just a little bit of Worcestershire sauce, <laughs> a little bit of liquid smoke, and a little bit of liquid aminos and onion powder. And this is just for us to kind of baste our bacon while we cook it. And some black pepper, and that's just to lightly season the egg. So I'm gonna get a little bit of the grapeseed oil because I want the, the bacon to actually kind of cook, you know? So with this bacon, I'm going to cut it because it's so thick. You don't have to break your bacon up if you don't want to. You don't have to cut it up and separate it if you don't want to. That's just what I like to do because they typically come thick cut like me. <laughs> thick cut like me. Thick cut like me. Ew. And this just gives it like that smokiness. Like the bacon, honestly, you don't really have to add it if you don't want to, but y'all know me. All right, so while this is doing this thing, we're gonna go ahead and start on our egg on the other side. So this is weird, but I'm using butter and oil for the egg. Y'all, you can omit all this if you want to and make it as healthy as possible. Please don't be in my comments talking about how unhealthy this is. I never said that all this was gonna be healthy. I'm just making comfort food, food that you like, food that you miss, so that you don't backslide, okay? Don't eat it every day. Okay, so with the just egg, it's really nothing much to it. Shake it and pour. So what I'm gonna do is just pour it. Not in a special shape, but I needed to kind of go along it a little bit because we're gonna end up folding it. So let's go ahead and put some black pepper on our egg. I'm doing this because I don't want it to stick. Let's go ahead and flip our other bacon. Okay, so all I'm gonna do now is fold this over. Okay, so as you can see, that's our fried egg, and then we're just gonna get our cheese and let that do its thing. So what I like to do to help the cheese melt better is covering the egg up. And let's get our bread going. So we're gonna get our ciabatta bun, and we're gonna just spread butter on it because we want this to be super toasty 
and buttery and yummy. And after you get that butter nicely on there, just put it butter side down. This is not healthy, all right? So that cheese is all melted. This is ready, so all I'm gonna do is take it off and sit it off to the side so it doesn't overcook. All right, you guys, so now we have our perfectly toasted ciabatta rolls. They're buttery and toasted. And now all we're gonna do is put our bacon on. This is how they do it in the movie. Now, if I was making this for myself, I would just put jam or something on the bottom because I don't like dry sandwiches, but we are gonna do it how they do it, okay? And then we're going to get our vegan egg and cheese like that. And then next, you're supposed to just get a little bit of hot sauce, not too much, like she says, not too much. And so we put our hot sauce on, and all you do is put the top bun on, and that is how it looks. It's the Harley Quinn Epic Most Perfect Breakfast Sandwich. A little bit of hot sauce. Not too much. Not too much. Okay, you guys, let's try it. Mmm. Damn. This is good. You want a little more hot sauce? It's so good. Hot sauce on my burrito, baby. I told you. Oh my God, it's so good. And it's so basic. <laughs> All right, you guys. So there you have it. The Harley Quinn Most Perfect Breakfast Sandwich. We see why she went on the killing spree after this sandwich fell. It's pretty dang good for it to be so simple. If you try this, let me know. And yeah, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and click the notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload videos. Yeah, you guys stay tuned because I have more videos coming. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.